morning everybody so today I will be sharing my first embroidery project so this material is not made of flows so I guess this is categorized as crawling and here it is so um, this is my very this is like two sides of the pillowcase that I embroidery. I'll just call it embroidery because I don't know about crawling. So instead of using floss, I did use a yarn. So this is the side that I did first. And as you can see, it's, um, well, this is my practice project. You know, I'm, this is my very first, so I don't know what I'm doing yet. But anyway, I just watched a little bit of tutorial on YouTube and this is what I came up with. And then the other side of the pillowcase, I started doing the next one is the flowers. As you can see the progress I make here. So I was like trying the colors in combination, how it's gonna look. So this is my very first one here and I progress to the very bottom so this is like the very last one here that I did and here is the tutorial guys
attach the two pieces together make sure the right side is inside because we are gonna stitch the outer layer of the fabric to join it and now fold fold the other side for the zipper and pin the zipper the other side of the zipper and now stitch the other side of the zipper now cut a three inches fabric or five it's up to you and then fold them and cut them in half we're gonna use to the this to the edge of the zipper you'll see what I mean here like that and now here is the 20 inches get your scrap fabric attach them together and make like 20 inches and then fill them up for the fillings and paste the decorative stone into the center of the flowers just like this one here in the video alright guys so I hope you did find the tutorial interesting it's just one stitch that I made I just made it differently and so that I that's why I did it like faster than it used to be if you are like a beginner or something um, you will catch up to it because it's not that complicated and I will see you in my next video